subby tube update on the five yon. So we took out all the, or at least that one colorful red plant, the fake plant, and we put in all these plants. And I can see like a lot of the stuff on these have cleared up. A lot of the algae, there's still some up there. But, you know, the pleco likes it. I wonder if he's cleaning it all off. The tire bar is back there. The tire bar does have like this green sheen on his sides. On um, you know. He's not eating as well as he was in the bowl, surprisingly. In the bowl, he would actually come up and start eating whenever I fed him. But now he's, he, like, I think he always had the sheen when he was in the bowl. So he might be unhappy that he has nothing to chase and stuff. He's not really eating as much now. And it kind of freaks out when you put your hand near him, which I'm doing now. But he's not freaking out, though. I don't know why. He hides back there most of the time, and sometimes he'll come up out here. We thought he'd be happier, but I don't know. He's He looks alright. He hasn't really lost too much of color. He has lost red on his tail and some on um, his bottom fins. And the Pleco, nothing's stopping him. He used to be a lot more skittish, and now he's not. He's over there. But yeah, it looks a lot better now. We're going to get some probably black gravel or maybe just some normal river rock gravel and then take out all this dumb blue glass and whatever gravel. I'm surprised the Pleco's over here and not on his favorite spot underneath the filter, but, you know. It's just an update on the 5-gallon. You know, I doubt this tank will get real plants. Can anyone tell me, please, just, it's getting like a weird green kind of color on his on the black area you can't really see it very well because he's kind of back there but I guess you can kind of see it but not too much alright see you later